Hey guys and welcome to day 26 of making videos and having fun. I'm Alexander and today we're going to take a look at one of the games I'm best at in tier 10. World of Tanks. My object 140. My favorite tank in this game. I have a unique skin for it. I got two Christmases ago. A loot box. Yes, I do buy loot boxes. Only on this game. Only at Christmas. It's the only time they sell them. I have a mod that gives me statistics. I'm reasonably okay. The higher this number here, the better. There's two players in my team better than me. And two players in the enemy team better than me. I carry three types of ammunition. Normal, premium, and high explosive. Premium costs like ten times the credits. But I don't care. I'm very good at the game. I have a lot of credits. Let's just let these guys push ahead of me. There's four. Oops. Sorry about that. There's four tier ten tanks on the team, each team, and one of the tier ten tanks here. So I have a duty and a responsibility to carry pretty heavy if I can. Could have snapshot it there, but I'm not very good at it. I'm actually really bad at sometimes at that type of game play. Makes 30 over there as well. Hello. 316 damage. So, the idea of World of Tanks, if you think about it, if everyone does this, I have 1900 health on my tank. And at the top here, you see the two totals. So, we're at 24,000 health, there are 22,000 health. And if you do the damage of your tank in health, usually. If everyone did that, you'd win the game, right? Backing away here before this bat check can hit me. Try and get another shot into him. Missed. So, so far I've done 583 damage, it's also there. Two shots. I haven't taken any damage yet. I'm reasonably good at tier 10. I know there's these guys over here. Out the shot. From the T-34B, which must be somewhere over here, and the T-30 just hit me with a 690. It's got a very big gun. He's over here though, so I think I. Oh. There's lots of different camo. Tracked him. See that little symbol means tracked. He can't move. I got lots of assistance damage. This is my assistance damage. Where if I track a track a tank, I reckon the T30 is about here. As I didn't see the shot explode into the background, I reckon oh there he was there. And I shot him again. Done 1500 damage so far, and I've taken about 700 690 effect. Feeling reasonably confident. This is a game we probably do decently in. So I just fire a random shot in there. One more, but it's nowhere near. The uh, health pulls the two teams though is 18.3 to 18.0. So it's a relatively close game so far. It's my first game of the day, if I'm honest with you folks. Oh. Oh, I bounced the shell there. It was really lucky, really. Um, we might be three tanks up now, but we're down health, which means. You've always got to keep an eye on your map at the same time. This game is all about multitasking, and you've got to be getting some health back as we destroy that guard over there. It's all about... Okay, I'm not going to push because I bet you that T-30 is still here ready to snipe me. No intention of handing him another 700. That, ta that tank, the T-30 here, even though he only hit me for 16 690, his tank does an average of 750 damage. It can go down to as low as like 550 and up as high as like 950, so you have to be careful. Where was he? He was on this side of the rock, wasn't he? Let's see. Oh, at some point, I think, yeah, see, I got spotted. That little sign means my sixth sense has gone off. If you poke or if you get spotted when you have that commander skill, it'll go off six seconds after you've been spotted, it'll go off, so. 
I was spotted six seconds before that, which is probably about when I poked out of here. Because I am in a tier 10 tank, I really ought to be helping these guys here. These are all tier 9 tank, there's the tier 10 tank, but he's actually not got much health left. This game is a lot of sitting and waiting, a lot more of a chess type game than, say, uh, Fortnite or Wizard. Not Wizard, um, H1's the one. So he's totally snapshotting me, he's not even like trying to aim. You can see the green, I have a mod that shows me where they're hitting, green paint. He's trying to snap chat, snap hit my commander's cupola, which is a weak spot on the tank. I actually managed to hit his, I did 346 damage, he missed mine. We're now up in health and the map, the Arkhines are breaking through this side, Arkhines are approaching up here. We've got them pretty cornered. I'm just trying to stay alive as long as possible. The longer you stay alive, the more damage you do. You missed me. It looks to me like he's running away, so I'm actually going to sneak to get into this dip here. Behind this rock. Just got away. T thirty four B is right there. Yep. I can't really push on him. He'll be reloaded and ready to fire. He's actually full health tank, so farming him would be quite juicy. I can sneak a sneak shot there. I can. I hit him for three forty. I'm going to sneak around using the, this cover here to try and feather a shot to this guy. Nope, this guy can hit me for a thousand damage, so he will kill me if he hits me. I'm in no... I'm pressing my F7 key here because I don't want him to, to poke on me. I'm requesting fire and I'm actually going to ping the map as well. I do not want him popping up here. If he pops up, I'm probably just going to try and track him. There, there's his track. Yeah, he destroyed me. I did get a penetration shot on this lower cupola, but he did blap me for the rest of my 630 damage. He also firing a heat shell. We should win this game. We're quickly going to pop over to this Progetto. Still hiding back here, huh? Who else is going? Really is. Have you watched the Ellen game? What games? The what? Right, back in a sec, boys. Okay. So that game ended in a draw, folks. Um, quite a lot of games do. On to the next one. Okay, so uh, round two, folks, in the Object 140. Um, some games you just can't do anything else, and uh, even if you play fairly well and carry fairly hard, you will still end up drawing or losing the game, and for the purposes of winning, draw is the same as a loss. Because um, it's not a win, and this game calculates out of, a, out of all your games how many have you won. This game is Abby, one of my favorites. We'll be dabbing the two key, also known as loading, loading the gold or loading the premium or dabbing the skill key. These shots have an average, it's an average penetration, it's like a average penetration 
of doesn't even pop up. When I'm driving, it'll pop up. Long story short, these sh these guys have higher average penetration. Always play the one-two line on this tank. Either have a good game or a bad game. Okay, let's see. Average penetration of 330, average penetration of 264. They outdated this game a little while ago to make the physics, make the fact that if you fall off a cliff, your tank will actually lose most of its health or all of it. So you can no longer as rodeo as it was. Be more careful. You can push someone off the sides as well and hurt them. If you hold your uh, right mouse button down, your turret stays the same. You can rotate your point of view. So I'm going to push from here all the way around. Get a hull down in a little area. I'm one of the faster tanks in the game. I see these guys are all going to come around behind me. Sometimes some guy beats you up here. Yep. So I, I fired as fast as I could. Then I just duck out. I'm going to poke out these bushes, see if I see anyone in the city. This is sometimes where bad guys post up. Buildings are blocking my shots there and there, so time to rotate the gun around and see what I can find out here. Oh boy, I'm going to repair that now. Repairs my 6 key, 50 B. He did 354 damage to me and I took 275. Not a good trade, but you never ever want to trade in your medium tanks. He spotted me and I haven't spotted him, so. Must have poked part of my tank out. So sure we know he's still there. Just the S7 key tells people help, and then I'll just point here. Yeah, see again. Okay, that guy's there. So we're already winning this game quite easily. I may be doing absolutely nothing, but we're winning this game. We're 5,000 health up, 3 nil. So, and in fact, we seem to have pressed all the way to the base. Their artillery is making a run for it. I'm locked down here. I really can't do much. Die, I can. I didn't even notice I could. I tracked him. I'm just gonna try and farm him real quick. This isn't good gameplay for him, but it's good gameplay for me. I missed it. I missed. Alright, let's go again. 300 damage. Pull back. Push forward. Back, push forward. He did damage to me finally. He's now gonna try and retreat. No, I can't get a shot. Not bad. I did three shots to him for shot of damage he did to me. Now we're going to push him and kill the Centurion AX here. We're actually going to hit him in the tracks. Put him in place and that also means if anyone else hits us. We do the damage. They've, he ammo racked me there. You'll see the uh, ammo the hurt, the hurt the, uh, when my storage is hit. He can actually kill me now. Until he fires. This means it takes twice as long for my tank to reload. Kind of impressed I managed to uh, get those shots off there. There's one tank left right here, but we're not going to be there in time. Any damaged him, I don't think. I run around, the, run around this E75 here real quick. And sniper shot in. I got a 
tracking shot in too. So all that 843 assistance damage. You always want to go for the tracking shot because if you track them, they can't move. And anything, any other damage any other tank does to them counts as 50% damage when assigning experience and credits at the end of the game. So that was a pretty good finish for me there. Um, that'll be all I'm going to show you. It's two games of my favorite tier 10. Um, I'll apply that bonus to experience. Um, yeah, third in experience in the game and second in damage in the game. Um, yeah, it was pretty good. This guy who's white means he's hiding his stats. Yeah, I'm going to guess he's a very good player and he has 60% win rate. is insane. All the best, guys, and I'll see you tomorrow for another video.